hi everyone welcome back to my channel and thank you all for the support sorry it took me time to upload video hence i apologize for the delay today I'll, i will be showing you how to make this ball dress um, as i actually made this dress for my friend beatrice nicholas um, beatrice is a pianist and she wore this dress for a 90 one art club live concert that took place in london perhaps you might like to know what beatrice do and you might be interested in knowing more about her so i'll put the link of our youtube channel in the description section and you can always like send her a message or talk to her so without much talking let's go into the dress so the dress has the top part which is the piece you can see on the table here and this piece was drafted with the princess bustier method i have a video in my channel on how to make a princess bustier cut um on your dress so use that concept to draft your own and put your neckline wherever you want it and that's it there for the skirt part of the dress i did a bias grain folding like i folded the skirt into the first half and then the next half so it was on a bias grain i folded it so for those who are seamstress they know how to fold in bias grain then i took the waist divided by four a measurement and i placed it in this direction as shown on my picture then the next thing i had to do after doing that was to make a mark of that distance on the fabrics so that would be like a guide mark in doing uh, the uh, in taking other points because i want to create like a circular curve although it's not a circle it's waist divided by four so at the top of that fold line i'll just go and measure where does it fall on that line that um, straight line so it falls on 12 so I'll use that to create more points so that I can have like a slanty curve along that um, skirt line for the waist circumference just watch me how I do it and understand it it's quite easy so that was what I used in making the lower half of the skirt so I'll go ahead now and cut it out The next thing I have to do now is to take the full length of the measurement of the skirt, which is 43. I did that across all and I created a curve and then I cut out the side seam panel for the skirt. So that's the end of the skirt fabric. So I have two different pieces for the skirt uh, fabrics. Remember, this is a ball dress. So you have to repeat the same process in cutting the lining. But what makes it a ball dress is the use of a petticoat net, like creating a gathers on your net. That is what actually makes it full and give it that flowness you want with a horse hair braid at the hem. So that's what I used to create this whole thing. I hope this video was helpful. Please don't forget to subscribe and like my channel. Thank you.